up tunnel. Dark tunnel. Welcome to a new make. Actually, it looks like something's on the lens there. This might be a shadow. Anyway, as I said, jeez. Yeah, wait, uh, don't skip past it. We haven't done it all yet. I've got a helper today helping me do the online shop, as it is, because I had a bit of a wrist issue while I was doing it. So, Poppy's doing the dib, 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 dab, 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 <laughs> ordering. And I'm telling them what to order. Let's go and work. We didn't go swimming. It's freezing. Isn't it? Freezing today. Plus, I'm going to cinema tonight with Holly to watch that new Fantastic Beast film. So I didn't want to make things, you know, worse where I could be in more pain than I already will be. So we're going to have a game today, aren't we? Games, and then I've um, more like games afternoon. <laughs> yeah, I've promised them a Domino's for lunch so that's what we're currently doing holly's upstairs doing work doing work shut curtains we've got our dominoes don't know why i've turned northern i'll put my drink there for now okay oh get a bit dark isn't it oh, where's my pizza? can't see anything now all i can see is the humidifier and the telly and the fire Getting in the mood for our film tonight. Remembering what it's about. What is it? A submarine. Can't say no to a submarine, can you, Eve? Eh? <laughs> what are you nodding for? How do you even win Monopoly? The well, other person loses all their money. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Well, we're playing, we're playing Minion Monopoly and listening to Greatest Showman Reimagined, which is a brilliant okay. album. Let's see. Probably a one again. Bit of a rubbish spin. What was it? A three. Pack one, please. What? I bought it. <laughs> Already? Yeah. Cheek. Champion! Champion! Loser! <laughs> She's collapsed. Oh yes, Mummy won the Minion Monopoly. Right, Poppy's done all her dominoes. Okay, ready? Go. Yay! At the range today. The Christmas stuff. Oh, look at that. That's sweet, isn't it? Oh, and print box. Yeah. I like the snowman. <laughs> yeah, I love these. It's supposed to have lights in them, but they're not actually working. Someone had one of them on their vlogs, a fish bowl with a display in it. Well, I do like the centre in the um, bottle Ooh, lit up. That's nice, isn't it? I like that. that. Is nice, yeah. I like them, but they haven't got price on them. They're free. No oh. price. Mum's chocolate shopping. Need some more frames for me craft, right? 
When it rains, look for rainbows. When it's dark, look for stars. $12.99, I love that. Look at our trolley. A lot of food, admittedly. Mum and Dad look at the table. No? Oh. Oh look, it's a past the polar bear instead of the sprout. Oh yeah. Got past the penguin. Past the penguin. Tacky tinsel. Yeah. <laughs> Elf on the yeah. shelf. Be up the mark. Yeah, he won't need that. He already <laughs> looks like it. Slay of jokes in there. Elf cook naughty supply. elf jokes. <laughs> Cookie supply. Oh, I love that. Isn't it lovely? It's lovely, isn't it? Three pounds seventy-nine. <gasps> Look at the wine glasses. Would you like one? I Oh, I love them. Let me look at this one as well. What would you like? I think I like the red one. Yeah, I like the red one. I'll get you one of those. Let's get one without knocking everything else over. Oh, I love what that. About one of Christmas galore. Very nice. That's nice. Gorgeous. Dad's investigating the lights, is he? So much Christmas stuff. Oh yeah, sent oh these are more expensive than when we went to Alton's. But these were what I want centicles for the tree. It makes all the tree smell nice. That's a nice bushy tree. 99. Oh, now, if you ever want little hooks for your Christmas decorations, these are brilliant because they just peel off. You All just right. stick them on and they're little invisible hooks. What is this on the what? what for you can put anywhere. anywhere. Do they leave a mark or anything? It shouldn't do. No. I've literally, I've still got mine up on the banister where... Oh, where you used them last year? Yeah. I just leave them up because you don't really see them. Hello, I just thought we got her back and I'll go through everything that I've got with you because you know it's a bit hard to show you what I'm buying when I'm actually going around there. I've got Mark a box of biscuits which he's going to be made up with because he's got his favourite jammy dodgers in. This was £2.49 so if you never need a present for anyone £2.49 I think anyone would be happy with that. Um, I got some sweets for my nephew, he doesn't watch my vlogs, that's fine, I can say that, as part of his presents. And these were 3 99 but you get 28 packs of Haribo. So that's good. Now these I got, look at this. They are the chocolate shells, you know, a bit like Gillian, but sort of a knockoff of them. And they were 2 99 for this sort of yard of, of uh, seashells. And I always get these for Christmas Eve because my mum and Holly love them. So that's their Christmas Eve treat. Right, what else did I get? More food. I always get their crackers. one ninety nine for a tub. Because I think you could, it's just nice to put them on the table. You don't actually need to dispense them. So just leave them there and then put the lids on like after each day. So they were, yeah, we've got a pub mix and a like a savoury cracker they were 1.99 each got some more merry christmas stickers from a christmas cards i've got two more box frames i've got a diamante one and a plain one um because i'm making some pictures for christmas presents and then i got two mini ones because i saw 
these little ideas of pebble pictures with that make them into reindeers so have them like with little antlers and things and so you use like little twigs so I thought I'm going to do that so I've got them oh something else in here guineas see even the guineas get a treat and they've got some hay as well I wanted the big bag of hay but I couldn't find that they just had the smaller ones in so that'll have to do them for now just fold my bag up this bag is brilliant by the way a bag inside a bag or whatever it's called it just goes down to like that I got this when I first went to America in 2012 was it and from Walmart I believe it's the biggest bag in a little thing that I've ever seen so I use it nearly every day but I've asked Tej to look out for them because I can't find one quite that big here Christmas baubles now look at that would you just appreciate that? I actually got two of them. They are so pretty. I love, love, love them. They were about one seventy nine each, something like that. And they're not glass, they're plastic. But I think they would shatter if you dropped them. And then these two beauties. Again, they're about £1.69 each. Uh, but the glitter does come off, I think, of them. So you have to be a bit careful with them. I don't want to be covered in glitter and I could not resist this look at that cushion 6 99 now this has got glitter on it and I kept doing this in the shop and I said to mum I don't want the glitter to come off I don't think it does I've got a couple of specks on me but I think that's from the baubles and then it's got like this really soft it's got a load of thread on it soft bit on the back so that's going to go in the lounge because I love that if you have anyone like we have Mark uses the hair gel the Brill cream is the best one and oh I didn't realize I've got one wet and one strong oh well it doesn't matter um now in the shops these are at least three pound fifty if not more 1.99 each at the range so I've got two this is the best glue if you do craft the range sell so this stick it I used to use boss stick until I found this and I tell you why I like it it's because you only need a little bit and it's quite 3d glue so you can use it on anything I tried these I well I haven't tried them I'm gonna try them they're vacuum fresheners flower garden you put it inside like the drum where you vacuum where you hoover everything up and it's supposed to make everything smell flowers so I'm gonna try that Dove body wash. Me and the girls both use this. So obviously we're going to get through a lot in the shower. Usually it's about £5 for one of them. £1.99 in the range. Massive saving. Stocked up on me Christmas do flora scents. Oh, if I can pick it up. So I got cranberry and orange, warm cinnamon and winter spice. So we're going to be all Christmas smells now. These are brilliant. I'm so pleased I found these and they're dishwasher safe they're just plastic Christmas bowls but you can put like you know like we tend to have a big bag of crisps or something to put in and I've always used my own ceramic dishes but these you know they're just so much easier aren't they to get out really oh and I've got a book to look at later if I hadn't looked at everything enough already so that was it Apart from the guinea's high so I did quite well I think um I saw in there a wreath not a reef a garland I keep getting them two mixed up a garland and a reef but I saw a garland beautiful it's got like mistletoe and berries on and it all lights up 7.99 thought that was really good value so I'm going to get that for the dinner table put it across I've got like a runner so I'm going to put it across the table runner but I'm going to sort of make it wavy and then in between I've got these candles that have like a fake flicker light in them. They're beautiful though, they're not like tacky ones. And I'm going to put them in amongst it. So yeah, I didn't get that today because I thought I want to spread the cost of things out a bit. So I'm going to get that. I'll probably go with my mum at some point and I'll, I'll get it then. Good morning. Yes, it is still morning. My nails coming off. Can't wait to get my nails done on Friday because I've lost that one, and this one is now lifting. So 
be glad when that's done Friday. Um, it is Wednesday today and yes sometimes I go to seated yoga on a Wednesday but at the moment it's hard to fit it in with everything going on and hello. so yeah hello I'm doing one that I do online on YouTube I will link it down below for you so it looks like that if you so that's like the thumbnail if you want to follow it but it's really good it's really easy and also I've started um, burning my humidifier with this oil if you can focus uh, women's balance from Neil's yard it's called and you put six drops in some water my one changes colour and it puffs the, it out and it's just such a lovely smell. It smells like a spa. So nice. So I've got that going as well. Right, socks on. Good morning, only just. It's 11.33 to be precise. Just putting my sockies on because I've got cold tootsies. Um, hang on. It's Thursday today and I'm just sitting down to eat my breakfast at now 11.34. Cherries and yoghurt and nuts, very healthy, try to be, I try to eat healthily, noise in the background is telly because I like to have this morning on while I have my breakfast, something I do, um, Tesco's has been, it's a miserable day, absolutely miserable, so not sure about taking Evie out yet because I can't be doing with showering her. Um, and yeah I've just got a few jobs but I was like just sit down and eat your breakfast woman it's like nearly 12 o'clock and you haven't had your breakfast yet so that's why I tend to have my lunch like two half two because I'm not hungry until then because I've just had my breakfast right just thought I'd let you know let me turn this down for a minute just listening to a bit of Kylie Christmas as you do um, I'm not doing Christmas crackers this year at the table because we're hosting Christmas Day um, because one the dog goes mental at the pulling of the crackers two I think they're a waste of money and three I much prefer my idea <laughs> so I've ordered all these gift bags they're really lovely they were how many were there I hope I've got enough actually but there's anyway there's they were about four pounds on eBay and then I have bought a little individual present for each person and then I ordered some cracker hats from eBay so I'm gonna put a cracker hat in each one and then I got these really cute little chocolate bars for a pound I think they were the range as well I think they were um, not this time but another time I went I got them so I'm putting a little chocolate in each one and Poppy's going to write out a joke, like a Christmas joke for each bag. So I think that is a much nicer idea than crackers and yeah it might work out a little bit more expensive or roughly about the same thing because I'm basically spending about a pound per bag on the present. So say I've got eight and then I've done four for Boxing Day when we go out so that's 12 bags so 12 pounds well you'd already be buying two boxes of crackers wouldn't you which are you can't really get a box of crackers that's under like seven pounds now so i think roughly about the same cost but i think nicer so there's a good little tip for you it's the time has to call. i don't know what it is. Oh, anyway 
It's Friday, it's Friday, thank jolly, it's Friday. I don't know who jolly is. I don't even know what I'm singing, but it's Friday. So happy Friday everybody, end of another week, oh my goodness, another week over and done with. I'm off to get my nails done, and yes, I do have a Christmas jumper on. Oh. Um, because I'm going out with Tan later to a Christmas fair. So, I thought it's only right to get your Christmas jumper on, isn't it? And I've got Christmas earrings in, I've got, you won't see it from there, I've got little trees in. But yeah, I can't wait to get these nails done, they're driving me mad. This one I keep catching because it's lifted and oh, makes you feel ill every time it lifts off. So I think I'm going to go for white, white sparkly nails today with maybe either a snowman or a snowflake on the thumbs. So we shall see what I have decided to go for. Thank you very much for waiting. Very patiently. So what's everyone up to this weekend then? Have you got anything? Um, exciting on any Christmas lights there's a lot of Christmas lights turning on this Saturday and I really want to go to the Colchester one but it's going to be at night cold busy so those of you that know me will know that the cold straight away will affect my pain that over sensory with all the lights the noise and the sounds will affect my pain so is it wise to go? No, not really. Is it wise to stay in the warm, watching Strictly Come dance with a glass of wine? Yeah, I'd say so. <laughs> but anyway, if you are going out this weekend, have a wonderful time and um, wrap up warm is all I can say. Good luck to you. What else are we doing this? Oh, I don't know. I think Mark's going to get the Christmas tree decorations out of the loft this weekend as well because um, we're going to we always put them up the first weekend of December so obviously that's next weekend so he's going to get them out this weekend I think um, and there's probably tons more stuff going on next week it's crazy it is absolutely crazy I mean if you could see my calendar for um, December, I, I was saying to Teach yesterday. I spoke to him because he phoned me up and he was like, "Happy Thanksgiving!" And I'm like, "Is it okay? Because we don't celebrate Thanksgiving." But anyway, Happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> so, and I said to him, "I'm I'm more in the Christmas mode than Thanksgiving mode. I'm like wrapping presents and." sorting things out and he was like oh hell no and I said well yeah because if you see um, my calendar for December I, I'm not gonna I don't want to be that person rush I can't rush around so I don't want to be having to think oh, I've still got to wrap all these presents up I've still got to write all these cards I've still got to do this I've still got to do that and I appreciate for those of you who work full time, who have a family, and it is hard, it is hard to be organised and get all that done. But even when I did work nearly full time, I still managed to get it done early because it's just who I am and what I do. I get things done early, I get, I'm get, i organised. So, yeah, and then I can enjoy all the festivities going on in December because for me like I've said before it's all the build-up the build-up to Christmas is the best part now fibro update bling 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 last night was hell it was hell because I went to choir now I had to drag myself to choir because I kind of overdid it the last two days 
and it's made it made my well the also the weather has made my fatigue really bad so I dragged myself to choir because I can't go next week because Bobby's got a play on and I literally just sat there with my head against the door and I felt so sick because I get that nausea when I'm overtired but I was too tired to actually get up and go and get my anti-sickness tablets out of my bag it was crazy Angela was saying to me come on just go go home it's fine I'll walk and I'm like no no I'm staying because I'm so flipping what's the word stubborn I'm stubborn I know I am so by the time I got in oh that car should have waited by the time I got in I was a wreck literally anyway I think I'm gonna leave it here this week I hope you've enjoyed my my busy week as usual and subscribe if you're not done already hit the thumbs up and leave me a nice comment I always get the same people commenting I always get Ian thank you Ian I always it always makes me smile as well Ian when you comment because I always say oh look my number one fan has commented and also poison dark frog Tom yeah you always comment which is lovely um, but it's nice I like receiving comments I like chatting to you guys so give you know start off a chat I don't mind I'm up for it anyway I'll see you all next week